What's going on guys? We are back. We're going to be doing uh, this week's pop report update. This is going to be from July 19th to July 25th. Um, we're going to be going over PSA, PGX, and uh, HGA. So uh, if this is your first time watching this video, uh, the reason I picked these three is because they are the only three grading companies out there that um, that basically allow the user, the end user, to uh, pull uh, all the total graded cards. Um, SGC, BGS, they all have pop reports, but unfortunately, um, you you have to be very precise on uh, when you ask uh, that pop report to pull up a card. So it makes it very difficult to uh, pull in those, those uh, pop reports. So we will go ahead and start off with PGX. Again, PGX has not um, graded anything um, or added to their pop report in some time now. Um, I believe what I've been told is they are back up and running. They are supposed to be grading and sending out uh, cards uh, you know, uh, this week. So hopefully in the next week or two, we should be seeing some updates to their pop report. But until then, um, still no update for PGX. HGA, uh, basically in the same boat. Um, they did add six cards to their pop report, which was kind of weird. Um, not sure what that was all about, but um, I'm expecting uh, HGA is having some sort of pop report um, issues also may maybe some maintenance uh, going on with their pop report so uh, that's it for HGA moving on to PSA PSA uh, for this week July 19th to July 25th they graded a total of 154,850 cards which was a uh, decrease from the prior week. Uh, prior week's total was 180,000. So as we could see here, that's a decrease of uh, 25,698 cards out of the 154,000 that were graded this week. Uh, majority are basketball at 54,000, followed up by baseball at 41,000. And then, um, uh, TCG, the trading card games, uh, was at 29,000, and then football at 19,000. So they ended the week at 154,000, which is a slump from their previous uh, average uh, for the weeks. Uh, uh, partially, I think, uh, possibly due to the national and uh, the preparation for their on site grading at the national. So We'll see next week uh, what next week's numbers bring us. Uh, moving on to the individual cards. Uh, sorry, let me zoom out a little bit. And again, if this is your first time watching uh, the channel, this video, uh, we are what I call a rustic channel, uh, low budget. So if you're expecting uh, graphics and all that good stuff, uh, probably not the channel uh, to see it on. That's all right though. Good channel. Hit the like and subscribe button. Do all that good stuff. So back to our individual cards. Uh, Look at Prism. Uh, PSA 9 went up uh, by 77 cards this week. The PSA 10 went up by 50 cards. And in the week at 17,489 cards. Uh, Look at Prism uh, Silvers. PSA 9 went up by 7 and the 10s. There were no 10s created this week. Zion uh, Base uh, PSA 9 went up by 97 cards and the PSA 10s went up by 122, bringing the total of PSA 10s to 18,673. Uh, Silvers PSA 9s for Zion went up by 9 and PSA 10s went up by 4. Uh, Prism John Morant went up by 107 and uh, Prism Base uh, PSA 10 went up by 94. Silver PSA 9 went up by 11. And PSA 10 went up by 7, ending the week at a 1,143. 
move, moving on to football, uh, Patrick Mahomes went up by, um, this is their optic, went up by 13 cards, uh, PSA 9, and then the PSA 10 went up by one card for the prism, went up by 24 cards, and then uh, for PSA 9, PSA 10 went up by 15 cards. Moving on to Justin Herbert, Silver, PSA 9 went up by 6 cards, and PSA 10 went up by 1 card, and in the week with 68 cards to total graded. Uh, 2011 Tops Mike Trout Update Rookie Card went up by 11 cards, PSA 9, PSA 10 went up by 4 cards, and ending the total at 5,416. Fernando Tatis Jr., Tops Rookie, went up by 72 cards, PSA 10 went up by 122 uh, Cunha Jr., uh, Topps Rookie, went up by 19, PSA 9, PSA 10, went up by 34, and the Juan Soto, PSA 9, went up by 7, and the PSA 10, went up by 31. And then we're moving on um, to these cards right here. So these are uh, the Donruss, Zion Williamson, and did the week up by 11 cards, and the PSA 10 went up by 14. John Morant went up by 6, and the, the PSA 10 went up by 20. The reason I added these two cards in particular uh, specifically is because I think um, when the PSA service fee was, you know, 10, 15, 20 bucks, people were sending these cards in. And then on April 1st is when everything shut down, and everything went to uh, $300 Super Express. So whenever these two cards completely stop grading, I think that's going to give us the window or the time frame of the April 1st submissions at that point. So hopefully uh, that's sooner rather than later. So moving on to Prism, Trey Young, PSA 9 went up by 95, PSA 10 went up by 37. The Silvers, PSA 9, went up by 12, and the 10s went up by 2. Ken Griffey Jr., uh, PSA 9s went up by 28, PSA 10s went up by 1. So, and then um, I try to put this link uh, in my videos, but if you guys do, uh, check out this link. Check out all the work that I've been doing on the, on the charts. I have individual players. I have Michael Jordan, LeBron James, Kobe Bryant, uh, Zion, um, Jaw, Shaq, Trey. I have basketball. I have uh, some football. I have some baseball here. So that gives you the top three cards of each of those players and the total count for each of those players as well. And I try to do it every day, but unfortunately not every day I'm able to do it. So you will see some gaps in there. Um, and then also uh, YouTube channels. This is some of the research I've been doing on YouTube channels, different channels out there. Um, I just want to gauge the interaction that some of these channels are having with their viewers. Um, you you know, I think it's a it's a uh, you know it's not good. You know, I'm not sure exactly the word I'm trying to look for, but I think it's. Um, pretty bad whenever a channel just puts out content and never interacts with their viewers so this uh, spreadsheet here puts numbers to that so we're able to view we're able to see which channels interact with their viewers more than others and then I'm just working on different spreadsheets so uh, yeah guys just take a minute go through through the spreadsheet um, let me know what what you guys think and if there's ways to improve it let, let me know all right guys take care out there and be safe and i will talk to you guys again later